Hello and welcome to Blue Bottle Reviews. My name is Michael Phillips and I am here to share that good coffee brew method review knowledge with you. And today we are going to focus it squarely on this coffee maker right here. This is the Hario Nell drip set. This isn't the most commonly encountered pour over device. You won't find it in cafes in the US all that often. If you're lucky enough to get over to Japan, you might find it in some old Kisatans in Tokyo. The reason this is so popular over there is it produces a very unique style of coffee, a very meditative process. It tends to be a slower brew technique and it produces a thick, viscous, sweet, focused cup of coffee that is truly special. So today we're gonna to take a look at what can inspire such devotion and look at what are some of the great benefits of it and some of the things that might be a little bit more challenging. The Nell Drip Set produces what is arguably one of the most unique profiles from the pour over category. Most pour overs you're gonna find out there, well, they may have different brew bed dynamics, some are flat, some are conical. Most of them do lean towards using a paper filter, whereas the Nell has the signature of using the cloth filtration. This cloth filter allows you to get a very textured cup. On one end with paper filtration, it tends to be very clean and crisp. On the other end, you have metal filtration that lets a lot more sediment and oils through. This exists in that world in between the two where you're gonna get some of that texture and body but still have a lot of nuance. Another thing that makes the Nell Drip a little bit different from other brew methods is that the filter is designed to hang free of contact with the edge of the dripper throughout the brewing process. This means that the water can exit the filter at multiple points as opposed to just the bottom of the filter as you have in other drippers. While the result of this isn't entirely quantifiable, it is something that is a little bit different that allows you to experiment with different techniques. You can also fit a much larger dose into the null dripper while maintaining a more vertical column of the brew bed. What that does is it allows you to have an extraction where the water is going to pass through a good majority of the grounds as it works its way to the bottom. This lets the Nell achieve that signature, thick, densely textured flavor profile that's such a strong part of its identity. One last benefit of the Hario Nell drip set is that this is probably the pour over method that leans the most into that ritual aspect of making a cup of coffee. It's gonna be a slower, more meditative experience everything about it feels like it's just a little bit extra special from the materials used in the brewer to the small finite textured amount of coffee that you get out of it. It's very meditative, it's very focused, and it creates a really special moment that separates itself from a lot of other pour over methods out there. With so much about this brewer being unique, it brings along a few challenges as well. You can use a similar recipe in pour over technique that you might apply to another coffee brew method like our Blue Bottle Coffee Dripper or a Chemex to get a slightly similar cup of coffee, maybe with a little more texture, but, but why would you? Everything about the Nell drip set begs to create something special and unique. However, there's not as many resources available to learn how to do that. We have a wonderful video guide you can follow along with, but aside from that, there are going to be less resources for this dripper than you might find with other ones. Working with a cloth filter adds an extra level of maintenance to the Nell drip that can be a bit time consuming. After you finish brewing, you wanna make sure you empty out the grounds right away. You need to rinse the cloth filter very thoroughly. Plus it should be stored in water refrigerated to keep off flavors from developing. Lastly, the Nell Drip doesn't make an enormous amount of coffee. And in addition to that, it makes that small amount of coffee rather slowly. So if you're looking to fill up a large travel mug on your way to work, this isn't gonna be the coffee maker for you. If you have the drive to experiment with this unique brew method, it can provide you with a decades long journey that can be very fulfilling in learning how to make a magical cup. So with all of that information in hand, now it's up to you to decide if the Nell Drip Set is the right brew method for you. Hopefully we've helped you come to a good decision and if you're curious about any other brew methods, we've got reviews and how to's for those online as well. Give them a look. Give us a follow and have yourself a wonderful day. Thank you for watching.